A comparative study of college students' attitudes before and after the introduction of Fujo T. Picking Opera into Course. This article is written by three authors. First author Fen Lu. Second author Praveena Manoharan. Last author Wen Li. Contribution and originality of the study is that, the innovation of this study is that it is the first time to combine Kodai music method with traditional Chinese tea picking opera curriculum, and examine the relationship between the students' attitudes towards the curriculum and music cultural inheritance effect. This paper takes the music class of Fuzhou Preschool Normal College, Jiangxi Province, China as a case study to analyze the different attitudes of students to the traditional Chinese opera, Fuzhou Tea Picking Opera which has been introduced into the music class of the school, thus affecting the cultural inheritance effect. A total of 150 non-music major local college students were selected from three classes to carry out the music course inheritance practice for four months in Fuzhou Preschool Normal College. This study was divided into three stages, A. Student Assessment, B. Teaching the Lesson, C. Feedback and Assessment. The aim of this study was to study the perceptions of students from Fuzhou Preschool Normal College, Jiangxi Province, China towards the art from a Fuzhou tea picking opera, and to explore the factors affecting the learning attitudes of these students. Mixed methods design was employed within the study. The study found that the implementation of the course significantly improved students' positive attitude towards Fuzhou tea picking opera. The implementation of the course played a positive role in promoting the inheritance of the tea picking opera. Although this is a study on the inheritance of traditional Chinese music course, the ideas of course design and research results are applicable to other traditional Chinese music, and even to other countries which have needs for the inheritance of traditional music. Thanks for watching this video of International Journal of Education and Practice Volume 11 Issue Number 1.